Hey guys, welcome to my channel, and today I kind of wanted to do something a little bit different, something a little bit more personal, uh, something I haven't really done in a long time. Now, I used to do this a lot back when I first started making YouTube content back in 2016. Isn't it crazy it's really been that long? You're probably thinking, why don't you have like a few thousand subscribers? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um... I wanted to kind of talk about a few things that's been bugging me, plaguing me lately. And you could probably see in some of my content, um, at least the last few videos and maybe streams, how I've actually been uh, presenting myself. And I kind of noticed this um, going back and watching the last couple of videos. Um, I looked like I was not enjoying what I was doing uh, at all. That's what I looked like. I looked like I was not having fun at all. Um, the truth is, uh, I've been having a lot of problems lately, just mentally. Uh, those that don't know, I have severe bipolar depression. I know. You're just another neckbeard with depression. Fuck you. Yeah, yeah, I'm just another neckbeard with depression. Sorry. <laughs> but it's, it, you know, it's true. I take my medicine take my medicine every morning, every day. I talk to my uh, counselors once a week. I've been like this for a long time, for a very long time. And you can see it in my content as of late. Not to say that my content gets a lot of views in the first place. And I kind of feel like I've been discouraged a little bit when it comes to making content. And I don't know how I should handle it. Because I love making content as a whole. I love to stream. I love being able to show some of my videos I've made to family members. Or if at least maybe one or two people watch my videos. That makes me pretty happy. But the last couple of videos that haven't been that way. Um, and my depression has eaten me so bad. Eaten me really bad. And I want to say, you know, I... I like to stress the importance of dealing with depression because it sucks it sucks really bad it affects everything you do every single thing you do it affects it it causes you to question yourself um i'm hypercritical of myself really bad and you can ask anybody that knows me they know i'm super hypercritical um really hard on myself and uh, i've been like that for a while uh, for a long time and it, it does hurt a little bit. Um, and I've been trying to use YouTube and Twitch as a way to cope with things. Uh, I dive back into it uh, with Pokemon. Pokemon's my new thing. Now, I love Pokemon. And there's a lot of YouTubers that does Pokemon stuff. And I try myself to replicate and make my own stuff. Just viewing on other people's stuff, uh, content. I know my content's not that great. I, I'm going to tell you, it's not the best content. I like making it, and I kind of feel like uh, I can be a little bit more relatable than than being fake. Because I, I, I feel like you make a YouTube video, you always show the best side of you or the fake side of you, and I, I see that a lot. And I try to be real with you guys, try my best. Um, just be me, who I am. And that probably turns a lot of people off. And I do apologize. Um, I am working really hard to change things a little bit um, in the source of content. Uh, that's why, you know, this week we've had E3 coverage and we still have a few more uh, conferences to watch. And there'll be another E3 video. And we'll, we'll have that later this week. Uh, we have some Pokemon unboxings coming this week. Um, and I plan on making things a little bit better. You, you might notice on the last E3 video, but I did a little editing. Um, I'm not the best editor. I'll tell you that now. I'm more of a graphic designer, which that reminds me. I had a interview a couple weeks ago for a job. It's my dream job. It's a job I've wanted ever since I was in high school. Uh, and it's a graphic designer job. And I had the interview, and they said I'd be perfect for it. Uh, I haven't heard back from them, but I do call them once a week to uh, let them know, hey, hey, I'm still interested. I, I, you know, and I sent all my work and everything. 
and it's been kind of getting to me because I've been thinking, it's like, man, maybe I'm not good enough. Maybe I'm not worthy of it. I'm, I mean, I'm not necessarily great of great at many things. Um, I'm a, I'm like a jack of all trades of not being good at stuff, if that makes sense. Um, but I'm hoping I get this job. I really do. The job I have is okay, but it's only going to last for six months, and we're on month two. And I still haven't had got access to any of my stuff to do my job. Um, and I mean, it's not not terrible. It's just I don't know. I I, I want this job really bad. I I do. I do. I, I I think about it all the time. And I'd say if I don't get a job, I'll probably be pretty depressed. <laughs> I I just I just banking on it. And that's the thing about me is like. I'll look at something and I'll be like, man, I really want this. And it consumes me. It really does. I've had this problem since I was a kid. And, you know, I I look at things. I'm like, man, I really want it. And whenever I, the thing doesn't happen, and I know it's a woe is me thing, and you're not guaranteed to get what you want. Um, but I, I, I get hard on myself because, you know, the first thing I think is like, Man, I'm not good enough. Maybe I'm not good enough at all. And that's my depression talking, which that reminds me too. I have started talking to my counselor again. Um, I have started taking the different medicine along with my current meds, uh, and it's helping a little bit. Um, but my whole thing is just like, I just feel down lately, really bad. And it's shown in my content. And I hate that for you guys. I really do because that's not going to help the channel grow. Uh, it's not going to do much of anything. Um, it's actually going to make me bad, look bad, and scare you guys away. And I hate to do that. I don't want to do that. I want to bring more people in. I'd like for this channel to at least be semi-successful, something for me to be proud of. And I do plan on continuing going down that road, uh, try to improve when I can. Uh, get questions from the community, uh, work with other content creators. I, I'd love to do that. Lo I'd love to do that. I just hope my depression doesn't scare you guys away. I'm going to try my best not to, but I don't want to be fake either. I want to be relatable, you, relatable to you guys. I want you guys to feel like, hey, maybe I can message him and uh, talk to him and help me out and help you out. Uh, that's what I want to do. I want to be a friend, first and foremost, and I want to provide decent content for you guys. Um, and that's what, how you can tell on my streams. I'm a little bit different on my streams. Like, I'm more bouncy because I like one of my favorite things to do. I'm, I'm a gamer. I'm a gamer. I've always been a gamer, and I take a lot of pride in that. So whenever you guys see me playing games and I'm – chatty and everything like that yeah that's that's just who i am it's who i am uh maybe the youtube videos is not a, quite the best representation of who i am and twitch may be the best representation of me uh that you can get along with um but the door is open guys if you guys need any help whatsoever um need somebody to talk to you're more than welcome to message me. I, I I will definitely appreciate helping you guys out the best I can. Um, we got the nerds community. They're great people. Um, and it's just all along, like, I, I'm just hoping that in the future, I can improve for you guys and help the channel grow. I don't want you guys to be able to feel sorry for me. And I know you're probably saying, well, why did you create this video if he didn't want us to feel sorry for you? I just wanted to make something about me and kind of update you guys. I'm not trying to um, trying to get some viewers out of it. I, I, of course, I'd like to have more viewers, but I want to be open to you guys more than anything. I want to be completely open, and maybe I can help you guys out. But I do apologize how I have been lately. I know it sucks. Um, and I'm going to fix it the best I can. But I love you guys very much. And again, if you guys need me, just let me know. I really appreciate it. And we'll talk to you soon.